I'm encouraged that my white sisters and brothers are out there. That from Oscar-winning producer, director Spike Lee, describing the George Floyd protests. Lee just released a short film connecting a character in Do the Right Thing to the deaths of Floyd and Eric Garner. Clinical psychologist Dr. Jeff Gardier says he's not surprised that Lee is commenting on the diversity of the protesters. He knows other people are talking about it and has heard from patients and friends who happen to be white that they want to do more. Let's bring the good doctor in. Jeff, always good to see you. Great to see you, Bill. So is this uh, a little bit about just wanting to do something because of the times we're in? Is it about race? Is it about just caring for your fellow person? Well, as much as uh, COVID-19 has been damaging to everyone psychologically, I think more than anything else, it has really sensitized uh, people to what suffering is all about if they've never suffered before. And I think it has really allowed people to be more sympathetic and empathetic to one another. And the people that I've talked to, uh, black and white, and talking of uh, people who are white, a lot of them saying, look, with these major demonstrations and social unrest, um, this can go in the wrong direction. We want something positive to come out of this. So this may be the time to take on police brutality and institutional and day-to-day -day racism. Uh, I don't know anyone that doesn't look at the video and say George Floyd was murdered. In some of the other cases that Spike Lee and others lumped together, the circumstances were different. The narrative is certainly different. How much of what's happened here was straw that broke the camel's back when it comes to so many people of color uh, who are unemployed and out of work and with very few prospects ahead of them? Uh, I, I think uh, the point you're making is, uh, is great. The question is fantastic. And I think what happened was that people really saw what it looked like to suffer, number one. But number two, now that we're all in a state of doing some real soul searching individually and about our society, watching this person, uh, the way that he was killed, uh, in such a cold and non-caring manner, I think struck a chord with absolutely everyone. Hmm. That's a good point. All right, Doc, thank you. Always good to see you. Thank you.